It's understood police have arrested two more men linked to the JPEX cryptocurrency exchange platform, including a television artist. It brought the total number of JPEX-related arrests to 20. Jacqueline with more. As investigations into the cryptocurrency trading platform JPEX continue, a 28-year-old man was taken from his apartment in Tumun this morning by members of the Commercial Crime Bureau of the Police Force, with a car towed away for investigation. Around noon, another 29-year-old man was arrested in Taipo. The man was then taken to Namhang Chun in Yunlong, where his white Porsche was towed away. The sports car was believed to be proceeds from crime. Sources say the second man arrested is Cheng Chen He, a television contract artist who has a YouTube channel that talks about cryptocurrency trade related news. In the late night notice, cryptocurrency trading platform JPEX said 68% of its users agreed to convert their JPEX assets to virtual shares under the platform's proposal, which will proceed in phases. JPEX earlier said they would buy back the shares from users after two years with extra dividends offered under the plan. Some JPEX users who voted against the scheme said their own stablecoin Tether and Bitcoin in their accounts have been converted to JPEX's proprietary cryptocurrency, JPC, without their permission. But starting last night, JPC's price plummeted, once dipping to even zero. One JPEX user laments it is ridiculous that the platform changed their clients' funds wantonly, and she and other victims are trying to seek compensation from the platform through civil litigation. A crypto specialist earlier said JPEX still owns some 200 million US dollars worth of stablecoin Tether and suggested the police seek to freeze the relevant virtual assets. That would at least offer another avenue for alleged victims of JPEX to seek compensation. Jacqueline, TVB News.